Well, as you can see, we've only got one tree left with leaves on it. That's how far out we've been with y'all. <laughs> Long time no see, everybody. <clears throat> we thought we'd better explain ourselves. Yeah, we went to do this a uh, couple of weeks ago, but then Jones and the Travel, they did their <laughs> their thing and we have, oh crap, it pretty much sounds like them. So <laughs> we just redid ours. So if you watch theirs, you know what we have to say. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, but we just, uh, yeah, we figured we wanted to touch base, tell you where we've been, what we've been doing, why you haven't heard from us in a long time, and let you know when you're going to hear from us again, which is going to be very soon. Hey, don't blame me, because I'm not the one, I don't do it. She does all the, she does all <laughs> of the editing and fil uh, filming and everything. <laughs> I'm just the eye candy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we hit the end of summer and we were busy. I mean, summer was busy, go, go, go. And we got to the end of summer and then we had a whole bunch of unexpected stuff hit us. Not, uh, just stuff we had to work through mentally more than anything. Yeah. And we just figured it was, a, I'm being attacked by a small dog. Um, <laughs> And we figured it was just a good time to step back and take a break. And there was a certain amount of burnout just from a super busy summer. And um, and then other issues that had nothing to do with RVing or travel or anything that, that we just had to deal with. And so we just, we took a little break. And then we got sick. Yeah, that Kung flu got us. We got the COVID. As you can see, we're doing okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank goodness, but uh, yeah. The only good thing about it is, I don't have to take a bath for another month. She still can't smell me. <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, all things considered, it's probably a good thing. My sense of smell hasn't come all the way back yet. <laughs> oh, so, but no, we're doing good. We're fully recovered. Um, Grace is in the shop. Yeah, she had to, uh, she got sick too. She got really sick and we kind of, we were kind of, how do I put this? We, we knew it from Hutchinson because we had a sample done to the oil and that is what led everything into this. And we think the trip coming back from Hutchinson is what, she got the COVID too. Let's no, put it that way. That, that's when we started. We, so we did go to the National HDT rally in kansas yeah. that's where we caught the covid yeah and then um yeah we uh we had the oil uh sample done and it came back with some coolant in the oil not much very minuscule amount but enough to point to some kind of an issue going on yeah hey look out guys something's going on catch it now before it gets too bad so i knew the yearly uh service was to come up so i got a guy here in town uh to do it and he did his he did a service and he called us up and he says, hey guys, we got a bigger problem. You have oil in your coolant. Uh, and there was a lot of oil that was in the coolant. And I, I didn't know it because when we first started out to go to Hutchinson, I blew a line and it, it, no oil came out of it. Now, whether it did, should have or not, I don't know. But he... Uh, the way he showed us, <laughs> he took a blade of grass, probably about like that, and he stuck it down into the uh, reservoir. And it came back oily instead of wet. <laughs> so the oil cooler went out. Yeah. And... Thank goodness, because the other option was way bad, so... <laughs> yeah, it was either a head gasket. And if you go into head gaskets, you might as well just go ahead and get your, your engine rebuilt. And... Knock on wood, we've got a few more miles with this new cooler. Now, we haven't got it back yet. Yeah, so it kind of uh, kind of hosed our plans for we were going to hit the road right before Thanksgiving. And it kind of threw that all out of whack. Um, but we talked to him today. He felt like he was going to have it done either tonight or tomorrow morning. So with luck, we'll be able to pick it up tomorrow. 
and if we pick it up tomorrow we plan to get some miles on the road tomorrow afternoon yeah we've got to so, not that we've got to we have reservations at a place in mid texas and um so we want to get on with our plans and and we want to get there and uh, start our winter out yeah I and mean, we haven't even really made any plans for winter until recently because we didn't know what the situation with the truck was going to be. Yeah. So now we feel confident that we'll be on the road and back at it. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> and then um, video wise, we still have a couple lagging videos from summer, one from Cincinnati, one from Tennessee. So between now and the first of the year, we're going to get those out to everybody. And that gives us some time to get on the road and start seeing and doing again. And then starting out after January 1st, we'll be right back to our regular release schedule. She thinks. No, we will. <laughs> <laughs> we will be. <laughs> and with luck, we'll have some pretty cool stuff over the I've winter. been looking out for you guys. I've been saying, hey, hey. But she's been going, Hey is Shut the up. first stage of horse poop. <laughs> yeah, it is. Look out, a missile coming in. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> And, oh, Lulu's doing great. Yeah. Lulu's doing really good. She's still a little skittish about picking up. But, yep, she is doing good. We don't even have a yeah, uh, halter, whatever you want to call it. Uh, she just runs around the yard now. Yeah, she runs around the yard, runs out in the field. The only thing we have to worry about is coyotes getting her, but... We're careful about that. <laughs> but, no, she's doing great. Yep, she's doing really good. She has her winter wardrobe, so. <laughs> so that's going to do it for now. We just, like I said, we wanted to say, hey, let you know we didn't fall off the face of the earth. We are still here. Yep, we are. We are still here. Just uh, like we said, had some stuff to deal with and took a little bit of a break. And we're ready to jump right back to it now. She says she is. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> so y'all have wonderful holidays. We will have a couple videos coming out again, you know, between now and the first of the year. So keep an eye out for those and we'll see you soon. Yeah. And if we don't see you, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year.